Hi, you guys. Welcome into the channel. I hope everybody's having a good day. You guys, heavy ancestor energy on Tuesday, okay? Heavy ancestor energy. All right, so spiritual rewiring. God is rewiring and updating you, okay? So get ready to maybe take some time out, take some time away, or just need to take some extra time for yourself, okay? As you go through this spiritual transformation that we saw is coming through in Monday's energy. All right, so God says he is removing old, burnt, chewed up, and weak or faulting wires, okay, within ourselves, all right? This is the way God gave it to me, okay? So let's go ahead for Tuesday. Thank you, angels and spirit guides, for clear and precise messages. All right, so these faulty wires or chewed up wires or weak wires or burnt up wires, they look like damaged thinking, okay, damaged thoughts, um, feelings from past or prior situations and relationships, okay, old pent up frustrations, bottled up energy, all right, um, God says task completion, okay, you're done with that, all right, he says there is something he sees or knows that you have been asking and praying for, okay, but you are required to make room now, okay, so he's going to do his part, but we're called to do ours, all right, first thing that came out was Kodesh, sexual wisdom, the second thing that's here is Aphrodite, eternal love, okay, so God says make room, he says you have been putting whatever this is off, so some of you, it will hit different, it's just going to show up differently for all of you what this is that you know that you've been putting off or procrastinating on god is saying if you really desire for this newness to enter your life then at this time it is required for you to make room but it looks like this room that you make you need to make could be emotional room um and if it's not on an emotional level then for some of you this is something in the physical that you need to release okay all right because he's ready and preparing to bless you Okay, I believe that's all we have for Tuesday. The number two is very significant. Okay, we have Heke, past life healing here. Okay, let's see what signs are significant for Tuesday. Tuesday, thank you, angels and spirit guides, for clear and precise messages for Tuesday, this spiritual week rewiring i don't know why that's so hard for me to say <laughs> spiritual rewiring so if for those of you that have ever had to do any type of wiring work on maybe a radio or even your car hold on y'all let me go get my baby okay sorry about that you guys so spiritual rewiring i was saying have you guys have if you guys have ever had to do any type of rewiring to a radio or a car okay it's that type of a vibe so let's see what signs are synchronistic or significant for Tuesday. Tuesday, Holy Spirit. Thank you. Capricorn. Achieve. Right now, also, you could feel um, like, you know, making love, <laughs> okay, or just co-creating, okay? A fucus, divine warrior feel more aroused or more yeah i feel arousal sometimes i want to be arousing or a, like a spirit of arousal is here okay like you could feel more sexual and more tuned into your your femininity or sexuality okay divine warrior is here Y'all don't mind my puppy. <laughs> okay, let's see what Wonder Warrior has. Ooh, that's too many cards. Okay, it says you uh, you vibrate higher. I am worthy of a great life, okay? You are the zest, okay? You may need to get some lemon in your life. Lemon promotes positivity, 
Okay, add some lemon to your water. Okay, then we have the universe thanks you. Okay, if you didn't this weekend, you guys, make sure you get out and hug a tree. There's a rainbow energy here. All right, so this is letting me know. This says I am devotion, but it's letting me know there's something new coming in. There's that ace of pentacles that I called out on Monday. So that should be showing up for you as well. Something's being handed to you. Okay, um, something that's going to grow or something of growth or fertility, okay? At the bottom of the deck, you all, we got I am divine excellence, okay? Um, it says divine abundance. You're gonna receive some sort of communication about, don't put your fingers in this in his mouth, about some type of divine abundance that's headed your way, okay? Your ancestors are looking at you, they're watching over you, and they see you as divine excellence as well. So maybe that's the ancestor energy that I was picking up on. You guys, at the bottom of the deck was Scorpio. Let me let you know as well, the Reaper energy is here, okay? You guys, this has been your read for Tuesday. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye.